Hi everyone, it's Rhonda with Ideal Body Image and Ideal Weight Loss, still playing with our ice cream smoothie slushy recipes. Um, here is take two on how to use rhubarb as your vegetable. So two cups of rhubarb, which happens to be half of the frozen bag, so nice and easy. We're gonna do it this time with our wild berry fruit drink which again, I think this is a one carb. Maybe it has a half, but I, I know it's no more than one. So nice and easy. I'm gonna keep your carbs really, really low, which is going to make sure you have a really, really good weight loss. Tear a better hole in the bag than I did and it'll go better. So there's the other half of my bag. I used my other one on the pineapple version of this, which was really good. Sometimes if any of you have ever done the drinks, even when you shake them up, they're frothy. And I think that froth really lends itself well to this because it made it almost like, Joni and I were talking after we tasted it, it's almost like there was Dream Whip or cream or something in it. And I even let mine set on the counter to where the bottom was liquid. And I stirred it and it still had a really good froth. So six ounces of water. We're gonna put our wild berry packet in. And again, you could do the strawberry kiwi. I mean, you try it, play with whatever flavors you like. There's no wrong, it's gonna, it's gonna get you there. And we're gonna do two tablespoons of our Walden Farms. And mind you, I mean, we were laughing, I don't measure. I'm like, mm, that's about two tablespoons. You can bust out the, the measuring cup though, it's okay, the measuring spoon. And we're gonna put our lid on here nice and tight. And again, this wasn't super, super thick, but we liked the froth. So you could always drop down your water if you wanted. If you wanna try it with just five ounces or four ounces, play with it and you know see. But I thought it was a good texture. And here we go, blender. you can't hear me talking over that thing but it's important you hear it kind of hang up so just shake your blender because you want to make sure you blend it until it spins but again here is our concrete mm -hmm. as Joni called it Let's see if I can get it open there it goes so yummy gummy very nice mm -hmm. very thick Joni's coming in for her spoon she's like don't tell me twice or her fork I did bring spoons. I don't know where I put them. What do you think? It smells fabulous. Same, mm. same better. It's different because of the berry mm. wow. instead of the pineapple. Yeah. Mm. That really, is got really, really good. It really has a punch. It's, it is definitely a, a flavor packed. The pineapple was much more subtle, but here you go. One more yummy lunch to put to the equation. Don't ever tell me you can't get your two cups of vegetables on protocol. Have a great day, Joni and Rhonda.